right. Well, hello there. It is uh, Tuesday, November 21st. It is about 1230 uh, in the afternoon. And uh, the morning sale did did wrap up. I brought I brought a lot today, mostly because uh, of what I brought. So I have a box of Christmas fabric. I wanted to go through it one more time this year um, to give any anybody any last minute um, projects that they needed fabric for. So um, some of that sold. A lot of it is still available. So we're going to go through that. But that's going to be it for the Christmas fabric. Unless I find something between now and Christmas out thrifting, um, then I'll, I'll bring that. Um, but for the, the previous stuff, that's going to kind of wrap it up for the year. Um, then I had picked up some doll clothes and doll accessories like wigs and shoes, that type of thing. And I thought, you know what? It's just better to bring it all. Just bring it all to one sale. So I decided to bring both things to this sale. So it ended up being, <laughs> and the sale ran a little long. I think I went two, two hours today. Um, it ended up bring, being about 83 items, which way more than I usually bring. But I just didn't feel like doing the fabric. I mean, that's that's a lot of fabric just to do in a sale. So I wanted to bring something to kind of break up the fabric. And I hadn't brought any of the doll stuff yet. And I thought, no, nope, this is good. But I didn't want to split up the doll. I didn't want to have clothes one day and the accessories the next day or anything like that. I thought, you know what? I'm just going to bring them all together. Just We're just going to do it all. <laughs> so um, I ended up selling 50 of the items. Now, a couple of the items were duplicates. Um, or I had multiples of, so it's it's about 50-ish, and about 33 are still available. However, there's probably a little more than 33 because of the multiples. Um, but that's okay. That's all right. Um, so let's go ahead and let's start with what's still available. Let's, let's go ahead and do that. Um, so I think I'll start with the dolls. Let's let's start with that. Let me find Oh, let me find that on my sheet. Um Okay, one thing. Okay, I'll start with I'll start with one one additional thing. Um one additional thing is that through all of the clothes. Now there were some doll clothes, there were some baby clothes, which, you know, a lot of a lot of the dolls are baby and toddler size, so it makes sense that there's some baby clothes in there also. Um, but I had three outfits that didn't sell. And I thought, okay, it's what am I gonna do with three outfits? So the people who purchased from me, well, you're randomly going to be getting these three. So uh, let's go ahead and start there. I'm going to, so these three I pieces were not claimed. And you know what? The, for the people who did purchase, you're going to get, you're going to get one of these. Um, so if this is a little bathrobe or some kind of a little robe, little coverlet, um, and it is white. Then there was this little pink. I know it's not very flashy. It's it's just kind of kind of a bland shirt. It does have a little darker pink accents. And then there was this beautiful um, little pantsuit, uh, blue velvet. I I have not run a lint roller over it. It needs it. It's got lovely little lace leggings and this beautiful blue top on it. Um, it's got a zipper back. Um, so those three pieces, yes, if you purchased from me, well then you are going to randomly be getting one or whatever of these. However, however I, I decide to, to randomize that out. Um, but yeah, it just doesn't make any sense with just three pieces left. 
All right, so we're gonna go over then to the table and take a look at what is still available. All right, and we are gonna start with the doll pieces. Um, so I have hats. There are five hats in here. There's this one, two of this style, this little uh, thin one, and then this kind of basket weave one. All five of those I'm selling in a lot together, and they are $2. So $2, and you get all five hats. Uh, this little piece of hair, I, I just don't even know. A&D Ceramic Supplies. I don't know why Ceramic Supplies, unless they are ceramic doll faces I don't know but this is a really interesting little piece of hair I know nothing about it um, but that's a dollar this I think is kind of similar to this where it is an accessory piece like you're going to add it to the back like this one you add it to the back it adds a little extra fluff I think that's what this piece is also uh, that one is a dollar and then this little um, uh, gosh, what is this? A wiglet, a wiglet. There we go. Uh, that one is a dollar. The angel wings. Yep. It is a pair of angel wings still in the original packaging. That's a dollar. And then this is a mop doll face. It looks like a dog. Here is the back and there is a stick in it. Uh, that one is a dollar. This mm, extra small doll fringe hairs sewn on a ribbon. Um, so I guess that also is to add a little extra fluff. Uh, that one is a dollar. Um, then I have some of this curly hair. I have a white one and two brown ones. Uh, those are $1 each, and they are still in their original packaging, have not been opened. So $1 on those. Uh, this one is a long curly wig for an 18-inch doll, and it is brown. It has been opened, but I'm really not sure that's been taken out of there. Uh, that one is a $2, so $2 for that one. This is a big bag of brown curly hair, and part of it was out of here, and I really couldn't tell where one ended and the other began. So you are going to get this whole thing, and I don't know if this is you know, a wig, a part of a wig, just random strands, no idea. It's, it's confusing to look at. <laughs> um, so this whole bag is $2. And then these wigs are um, more like, like people wigs. They have the mesh inside of them and they have more of a structured shape to them. Um, these are all $2 each, and I have the brown one here that have the little side ringlets. Now, she doesn't have much of a back. She would probably need one of these little wiglets for her back. Um, then there is this one, which has a little tighter curl to it. So again, that structured inner, inner netting there. So that one has a tighter curl. These two are identical, and they have a looser, oops, a looser like ringlet curl to them. And so all four of those, these two are the same, but all four of those are $2 each. Okay, so I think that is all of the doll stuff that is left. Um, so let's go ahead and talk about the Christmas fabric. Uh, so the first one here is a reindeer. So it's a kit. You put it all together and you stuff it and then you have a plush Rudy reindeer from Daisy Kingdom. Uh, that one is $5. 
This Noel piece, um, I have four of these. They, they call them placemats. They are 17 by 14 inches. And we've got some geese and a sheep. And it says Noel on top. Um, so really cute placemats. Um, could be cute, sew them together, make a pillow out of them. Um, these are $1 each and I have four of them. So $1 each and there are four. Uh, this one is a baby quilt. And I, I'm not gonna, un not gonna unfold the whole thing. Um, it is snowmen. There we go. There's one of them. Snowmen and sleds. Um, if you want to see it, take go go back to the live sale and take a closer look. Sorry, it's just so hard to fold all of this stuff up again. Uh, so I'm just not going to unfold it. Um, but that one is a uh, five dollars, and I have six of them available. So a great design if you wanted to do the front and the back the same. Um, this is a nice size because it's a baby quilt size. So it is 36 by like 44 inches. Um, so it's a nice lap size. So great for someone who's, you know, sitting a lot, would like a little extra um, um, warmth on them. Um, if you want it in your car. Um, so that is a really nice size. It doesn't have to be just used for a baby quilt. You could also use that as a wall hanging also. This is just the um, additional ones for that pattern. Uh, then I've got this one. This uh, piece of fabric is 16 by 20. It is just $1. And it is... A cute little, they say 12 days of Christmas, but they have some silly 12 days of Christmas. Um, where is one of them? Oh, four mohair bears. And then the bear, the bear's heads are there. So that one is just $1 for the days of Christmas. Uh, this one, kind of a checkerboard with a Christmas tree. Uh, this one measures 32 by 20 inches. So 32 by 20, and that is $2. This is another uh, baby quilt, and it's called Bestest Friends. And they show this illustration so you can see that it can be a wall hanging or it can be a baby quilt. But that is so cute. Um, I have three of the these. So again, if you wanted to do a front and back quilt with the same pattern, you can do that because um, I do have three of them. They are $5 each. Okay. Let's see, those are the other two. Okay, this fabric... Um, this one was a little miscut, unfortunately. There, I'm going to switch hands here. Um, the tops of this one, for some reason, when somebody cut it, they cut too much off the top here. Um, but these, these are really cute. The illustrations on this are adorable. And you've got the snowmen singing. You've got all the little animals singing with them. Um, this piece measures 28 by 12. So this is about half of it. Flip it over. Here is the other half. You're going to get two of these for a dollar. So two of them for a dollar. I do have, uh, I'm going to say at least three more available. I think four. I think I have four more pairs of this available. So if you wanted to do cute little appliques, if you wanted to make little pillows, little ornaments out of these, that's going to be so cute. So again, these are two for a dollar and I have, oh, I almost didn't notice the cat joining in. And uh, they are, uh, I have four 
of those available. Uh, this fabric, this is originally um, for a jumper top for a young girl. I don't know anybody who's going to make a jumper top for a young girl out of this. But this has got a really nice collection of Christmas fabric. Um, it's a little hard to see because all of these are kind of rolled together, but you've got some plaid, you've got a Santa face, you've got some green polka dots, and then you've got this great design. Um, there are like two of each on each of the panels. I'm doing those two for a dollar also. So you're going to get two complete panels where you're going to get two of this design, two of this design and two of the plaid on each panel so you're going to get four of everything those are two for a dollar and i've got a lot of those okay then i've got this check pattern this is pink and green um, i also have a lighter version right here so this is the more bold version this is the lighter version this has gold there you can see it gold metallic accents this one has silver metallic accents i have three yard bundles so this one is three yards this one is three yards and then that one is three yards um, so they are $4 a yard. So each three yard bundle is $12. If you would like less than three yards though, I can cut that. So you can have less if you only want one yard. If, oops, I'm losing the hats. Um, if you just want one yard or two yards, um, let me know because I can cut these. Um, and then I have the cherubs. So really beautiful pattern, fun cherubs. Now this one, um, I have two different bundles here. This particular one is just one yard. So that's $4. This bundle is three yards. So that's $12. However, if you would like two yards, let me know because I can cut the uh the three yard down to just two yards uh, but that is really cute and this is a beautiful background design for them um okay so that is that is all of the fabric now i have christmas tree skirts also and the way i have them priced um is i have some that are just half of a skirt and here, I'll, the very first one, though, is going to be $5 because it is an end of bolt. And so it has this running all the way through it. I'll show you on this end. Um, this is Cherished Teddies. This one is really special because it is already pre-quilted. It's really cool. So I'll show you on the design and how this is going to apply pretty much to all of the tree skirts that I show. So this particular one that they're using as an example is a half skirt. So the design is just on one side and then they have put in their own fabric for the back side. Uh, some of the ones I have available are a full where you are going to have the design. You're going to get two panels. So the design on one side, and then you're gonna sew the design on the other side. Um, you can also make a tablecloth if you have a round table, and it gives you all the instructions on how to sew everything together so that you can uh, have a Christmas tree skirt. Now again, this one, which is really cute, but it does have that um, stitching through it because it was the end of the bolt. Uh, but that one is going to be just $5, and that is the Cherished Teddy's design. Now, I do have a half skirt of the Cherished Teddy's, but it is not quilted. And I'll show you, I'll show you that one. 
So you could actually have a full skirt of cherished teddies. You know, the first half being quilted, the back half not quilted, but this is the, the not quilted one. And that one is $8. So the way, except for this very first one here, because it has the bolt line through it, um, the way I have these priced is all of the half skirts are $8 and the full skirts are $15. So I have a half of the cherished teddies and that is $8. I have a full of the cherished teddies. This is two panels. So you're gonna get a full skirt. That is 15. Uh, this pattern is a Holly's and, Holly and Peppermint. So it's a beautiful pattern. It has an oatmeal style background, like a little speckled background. Um, I do have, I think four, four full um, skirts of this one. So the full skirts being two halves. And so I have four of those available in the holly and peppermint pattern, or maybe three. One, two, yeah, that might be just three. Oh, maybe I can find it on my notes. Three, I have three of those. Um, okay, then I have the nativity. Uh, this is a beautiful nativity and it has, oh, it's hard. You know what? It's hard to show here, so I'm gonna actually go. Hang on one sec. Okay, I'm gonna cheat a little bit. So I also have some fabric that is the nativity scene that is the same scene that is on the tree skirt. Uh, so we're gonna cheat a little bit. Uh, it has the wise men, and, oh, you can't see the star. There, let me open this up a little more. Okay, there we go. So it has the wise men and the star. You have the shepherd and the angels. And then you have the manger um, with the town behind. So those are the three main images that are on the, um, that are on the nativity, uh, oops, we're coming back over here, <laughs> that are on the tree skirt. Um, so in the blue, I have a half skirt um, still available, so that is $8. And then I have, let's see, one, two, three, I have four full skirts in the red. So four full skirts in the red and a half skirt in the blue. All right, so that is everything that is still available. Let's go over to the other side of the table and take a look at what's sold. All right, well, let's go ahead and finish with the fabric. So I have these transfers they are really cute. You're gonna get um, cat angels and dogs in stockings. Um, so that sold. I had two half yards and one full yard of the blue nativity and that sold. Um, this cute one with the gingerbread men and fabric, or, and presents, there we go, gingerbread men and presents, um, one set of those singing animals, a almost yard of the cherished teddies, one set of the jumper, uh, one full set of the blue nativity Christmas tree skirt, and then uh, the one set of the um, all about half a yard, I think this one is, of the, um, the checkered trees. Okay, so then let's go over the clothes that sold. Um, this one was actually a free item because it's got a little discoloration on it. 
Um, this is like a little lace with maybe a, it was going to be a skirt at some point. Um, <laughs> the panties. Yes, little doll panties because all, all the little dolls need their undergarments. A pink um, bonnet. This cute little baby t-shirt. This is a little one piece with a hoodie. Oh, and this one was funny because it has the little flap in the back that is open. <laughs> um, a terry cloth bib. This pretty little stripe dress. Uh, the bunny ear bonnet. These wonderful little, like little snow pants. Um, I have a feeling somebody was gonna make a pink poodle skirt out of that one. Um, this is a beautiful, look at that. Oh, isn't that so pretty? This is a gorgeous dress. And a nice full um, underslip. A little yellow dress with some hand embroidery. A um, little red flower dress. Um, these were fun. Little knit hats. There were three in that size. And then a matching sweater and a scarf. A little um, faux fur collar with a little pom-pom tie. We have the pink or the purple um, dress. Nice little winter dress. Um, another bigger pair of panties. <laughs> a little hat. This one was, um, oh, Babies Are Us. We've got Mickey Mouse. This cute little um, bonnet. Love this one with the smocking. That was a great dress. Um, this dress, oh my gosh, look how cute that is. And it has the little windmills and the little windmills in the fabric. And then this gorgeous lace dress with the pink flowers. It's a multi-tiered dress. That one was fabulous. So, so glad all of those are going to uh, new fun homes. Then we had some shoes, some ice skates. Um, the roller, one of the roller skates was missing the bottom. Little pom-poms crocheted shoes and a couple of the wigs and these ones were made out of wool that was really neat one of the long curly haired wigs for the 18 inch doll and then this awesome pink hat all right i'm going to turn the camera around all right just a quick interruption to uh the sale update um, I did um, sell this item, which was from Monday night's sale. I was contacted after the sale by someone who wanted to purchase the half ounce bottle of Interlude. Um, it came in this beautiful box and it's got a great cutout in the shape of the bottle. So uh, thank you very much. For, uh, for purchasing this awesome item. And now back to the sales breakdown. So, whew, it was a lot of stuff today, but I think you can kind of see why I didn't really break it up, why I just kind of kept, let's like, let's do all the Christmas fabric, let's do all the doll stuff. It just made much more sense. Um, and it was fun hanging out with people for a little longer today so that was great um, I am now going to get um, well I have a box ready that the fabric is going into if anybody wants any of it I can quickly get to it but otherwise it's gonna sit there a lot of this stuff is probably gonna get listed on eBay 
once I get to that point. Uh, it's going to get listed on eBay. And then some of the stuff, yeah, you, you may see that again at a later point. Um, the doll stuff, that was really the first time through um, with the doll stuff. So the um, wigs and accessories and things, they'll, they'll probably make it. When I do a crafting sale or so, they'll probably be making an appearance in there um, because that was just the first time through. And I know, especially this week being Thanksgiving week, a lot of people are busy. They won't have a chance to see the live sale. They won't have a chance to see the vlog. That's okay. That's why I, I bring things back. Uh, but I am then going to get the table organized, get all the items that sold upstairs, and I have to enter in my sales so I can keep track of everything. Um, and then I'm going to be upstairs for the rest of the day working. Um, I just have one package going out today, and that was that Etsy sale that I showed you yesterday in yesterday's vlog, that uh, floral pat platter. That was a hard one to say. Um, and then, yeah, I'm going to be working on invoicing and packing for the rest of the day. And that is pretty much going to do it for me. So um, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to leave your comments. Uh, so I can get you entered into the giveaway on Friday. Um, I will not be going live on Thursday for Thanksgiving, but I will be back on Friday. Um, so yeah, so I will see you tomorrow though for the double sale with Jen and Denise from Denise's Magical Emporium. So I hope to see you, which will be today. So I hope to see you. <laughs> <laughs> Goodbye and thank you so much for watching. I'll see you tomorrow.